Hi, today we're going to look at painting one of the outstanding US infantry figures from Team Yankee. I started by undercoating the figure black, then I sprayed the uniform colour of army green. You could brush the uniform colour on, this is just the way I like to do it. With the uniform colour laid down, I paint the exposed flesh with battlefield brown. Then I paint the Alice web gear with Sherman drab. After painting the web gear, I paint the leather boots, the M16 and the rifle sling with black. Then I paint the magazine with cold steel to simulate the unpainted aluminium finish. Following this, I liberally coat the model with a wash of Manstein shade. This step adds shading that picks out all of the excellent detail like creases in the clothing. Once the Manstein shade wash is dry, I move on to highlighting the figure starting with the flesh. For this I start by carefully painting most of the flesh with a 50-50 mix of Battlefield Brown and European Flesh, being careful to leave a little bit of the underlying colour in the recesses. I then complete the skin by painting the areas most exposed to light with straight European Flesh. Once the flesh highlight is complete, I move on to the uniform. I paint army green, being careful to leave the underlying colour in creases and other recesses. I then move on to painting the woodland pattern camouflage on this figure's BDUs. I start off by painting fairly large motherland earth cloud shapes running roughly horizontally on the uniform. A good rule of thumb is to cover 45-50% to of the uniform. Following the Motherland Earth step, I paint smaller horizontal cloud shapes with military khaki. This colour should go over both the green and the brown, and should roughly cover 10-15% to of the uniform. The last step for the woodland camouflage is to get a fine brush and paint small black branch shapes randomly on the uniform. Once the uniform is painted, I repaint Shimming Drab on the web gear and the elastic band running around the PASGT helmet, being careful to leave a little bit of the underlying colour in the recesses. The final step on the web gear is to give it a light dry brush with Comrade Khaki just to help it be a little bit more visible against the camouflage uniform. And finally I paint the rifle sling and parts of the M16 with worn canvas. Thank you.